What's good, YouTube? Welcome back. My name is Kelly, for those that are new. And today, I'm gonna show you guys how to get a wider, thicker, fatter vocal inside of Adobe Audition with one simple effect. Super easy to do, very helpful if you guys are making courses or you just want that surround sound, Travis Scott, yeet type vocal. It's a cool effect. So, I wanna record some vocals quick and then we're gonna add the effect to my vocals and I'm gonna show you guys how to do it. Gotta do it for the video, yeah. I swear I got a milli flow, uh, yeah. We ain't never slowing up, yeah. We ain't never going down. Now that we got our awesome hook, such a hit, now we can add our effects. So right now we have our maestro vocal preset on our vocals just to bring out the vocals and make them more clear. And now we're gonna add the chorus effect to make our vocals thicker. If you guys are unsure where to add your effects, just go to the side over here where it says track effects, click the arrow and you can add all your effects. As you guys can see, we have a few effects on the vocals already. That's my maestro vocal preset, which is making the vocals nice and crisp. But right now we're gonna add our chorus and flanger effect. That's the effect that we're focusing on today. And I'm gonna add this right after my auto tune. You guys have a few different options of presets to choose from. But to be honest, a lot of these presets are a little too much. They're a little aggressive. So I made my own vocal preset. You guys can check it out. Kelly Pre right here. Feel free to copy the settings. But uh, yeah, I'm going to play this before without this and then after and you guys can see the difference. Gotta do it for the video. Yeah. Oh, I swear I got a milli flow. Uh, yeah. We ain't never slowing up. Yeah. We ain't never going down. So I'm sure as you guys can notice, it gives you like a Travis Scott yeet style course. It gives you that wide surround sound type vocal and it can be very helpful when you're making courses to make the course stand out. But that is pretty much it. I just want to show you guys a quick little video on how to get some wider, thicker vocals for your course inside of Adobe Audition. Feel free to play with these settings and experiment all you want. But these are my settings, these are my favorite settings. Sometimes, again, like I said, it can be a little bit too much, some of these presets. So if you dial in these settings right here, it should help a lot. So, yeah, that's pretty much it. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Give it a thumbs up, comment down below, subscribe if you guys are not subscribed. And I'll see you guys soon with another video. Gotta do it for the video. Yeah.